Hey everyone, Animal Man here. Today I'm gonna to share with you a sad video. Um, two days ago, a good friend of mine, Deke, messaged me that there was a northern water snake being harassed by people at a pond around the corner from my house, and that I might wanna check it out and see what's going on and try to help it. So naturally I went there to check it out, and somebody had caught it. The snake was in very, very rough shape. I ended up bringing it home to try to take care of it, and it died overnight. Um, this probably happened because people mistook it for a water moccasin, they do not go anywhere north of Virginia. We're in Massachusetts. There's no water moccasins here. But time and time again, I hear stories of people, oh, a water moccasin attacked me in the canoe and I had to hit it with the paddle. They're not here. This did not need to happen. This makes me very upset. Um, I think it's okay to watch with kids. Um, my seven-year-old son was there with me when this happened, and, and he was angrier than I was about it, but he wasn't, you know, he wasn't, upset because of how how uh, graphic it was or anything like that. I mean, it's graphic, but it's not horrible, horrible. So, this didn't need to happen. I mean, all around the world with different animals that are misunderstood, you know, sharks and snakes and all kinds of animals, people think they're dangerous or they're mean or they're bad animals, and they're scared of them, and because of their fear or their ignorance, they act out and they, they lash out against the animals and they kill or hurt the animals or trap them. Um, this does not need to happen. It makes me very upset. It's got to stop. Heard there was a big water snake. You got him? What's the deal? Somebody heard it or something? Nah, not that I know of. Okay. Jackson, back up. Yeah, I have no idea. Oh wow, he's a big guy. That's a female. She's a big guy. Yeah, somebody else told us that. Yeah. It's a female. So a friend of ours told us it's all over Stony Enthusiast or something and people are all freaked out about it. Oh yeah, look. Look right there. Yep, she's injured. Uh, oh, yeah, she's oh, somebody, yeah. somebody broke her broke her back. Oh, yeah. Looks like somebody hit her. Yeah. And she's probably pregnant. Yep. Oh man. She's in trouble. Oh, she's not Ooh. feeling good at all. That's crazy. Damn, you got big balls, guy. <laughs> I work with snakes. Oh, okay. That's what I figured. <laughs> oh, my like, damn, balls. guy. You're She's... nuts. Oh, man. Oh, man. I mean, can you bring her to the vet, or would that not do anything? The vets no. aren't allowed to by their licensing. Oh, gotcha. It'd have to be a rehabilitator, but she's bleeding from it, too. So somebody, somebody whacked her. You can see her bones in there. Look. Tip of her tail is gone. That's probably old, though. That's yeah. old. But she's got a hole there. She's gonna die, I think. Yeah. Even if I brought her home, she would still die there. She might. I mean, it depends. She can still move, but sometimes the nerves do that on their own anyway. Yeah. Is she poisonous? No, it's a northern water snake. They're in the garter snake family. Yeah. So they're harmless, but everyone around here thinks they're always water moccasins, and water moccasins don't live around here. Hmm. They live down south. These are totally harmless. They just they like to bite. They're aggressive. Really? Yeah. But um. Look, she's just, she's we done. Fed her a, we fed, she was over here, we fed her a shark. Yeah, earlier today we were throwing her dead fish. Yeah. Oh yeah? She was eating the So you guys fish. didn't see er, anybody? Today, she seemed like her? she was fine. You no, know, we didn't even notice that. <coughs> yeah, you see the hole? Let me you see the hole there? Oh man, somebody. Yeah, somebody. Uh... No, that's fine. All right. All right, and I can't right. tell if this right here, because this is where the stomach is, two thirds of the way down. That's also where the babies are. I can't tell if that's um, food or if that's babies. What do they usually eat? They eat whatever they can find. They'll catch fish, snails, frogs, crayfish, oh, insects. Pretty, they are, especially when they're wet, they're beautiful. And their belly is really pretty too. Yeah. Their belly is beautiful. And this is just sad as you have. Yeah, it's a real oh, it's shame. People, people, people are really ignorant about stuff like this. Ugh. Oh man. You don't think she's going to live? Yeah. I don't. I mean, she's breathing. 
I don't know what to do. I mean, if we leave her here, she's probably just going to die out here. But if we take her in, maybe maybe this can heal. I have no idea. But the veterinarians it. around here they're, they're can't. Not. By the she's licensing, she's older. Bleeding, huh? Yeah, because mm -hmm. there's a hole. I can see her bones. Wow. Um, all the veterinarians can do is euthanize them. Otherwise, they're they're um, they're going outside of their licensing, and they can lose their veterinary license. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. It's worth a shot taking them home, isn't it? Yeah, I guess Especially I could. Like I got like a little, uh, like a little shiner bucket you can have. Oh yeah, to, to, to put her in. Yeah, and it, it has like like a cover and everything too. Okay. She's not poisoned. Does it need? Well. I live up the road. I can just bring it right back too. Now, how big? Okay. How big those things go? You know? I've seen up to six feet if it's female. Really? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Are you gonna put it in a bucket with water? No, no. They only need water to, to bathe and to drink or whatever, buddy. They don't need to live in water all the time. Does she need support in that injury area? I don't. I'm afraid to touch it too much. I don't know. See it right there. Oh man. How long are you gonna keep it just for today? I don't know. If she's gonna die, she might just die overnight. See her face. And she's not. She's not a nasty one or anything. It might be because she's just exhausted, but I don't know. So guys, this is a northern water snake. They're totally harmless. They like to live in the water, but they're in the garter snake family. No fangs, no poison. They do get aggressive, and they will bite you, and they'll musk on you, but they really can't hurt you. You just wash it with soap and water, put a bandaid on it. But you shouldn't mess with them anyway. But this happened because somebody probably thought it was a water moccasin and tried to kill it and whacked her, and now she's probably going to die, and she might have babies in her belly. And they give live birth up to 100 babies a year. Thanks, guys. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> on there. This one, that one goes with this one, but it's not working all too well. Thanks. Always keep her, keep her in there to make it hold. That one definitely works a little bit better. I'm gonna throw that one around. Yep. I'm gonna bring it right back. Yeah, it's like three bucks, or so you got. I like, live like five houses up. It's not yeah, a big deal. Okay. It's not a big deal. All right. Yeah. Yeah. All right, All right. Guys. yeah. Thank you, guys. All right. Let's see what we can do.